quick one. Do you have a date that you're training for? Do you um, know when you're likely to be fighting next? I want to be back out next year. So obviously, I want to get back into training so I can work on my strength and fitness. So I've got Tony Brady flying over. Uh, he's going to be here in Doha with me while I'm here. I think you know, the weather's nice as well. I can just get away from all the distractions at home. I'll be focused on training. Um, so while I'm here, um, we're going to be doing a lot of strength conditioning work and everything else. Yeah. yeah. But it'll be next year rather than getting one early in before next year, the yeah, end definitely. of this year. Yeah, I'm not going to rush into it. No, I'm not going to rush into it. I want to probably early, early next year, I'll be back in the ring again. Yeah. I mean, has it been frustrating for you in terms of your career, having to wait yeah. for Mayweather, having to wait for yeah. Pacquiao? I mean, look, you know, we, I hope we're not in the same position where we're going to have to wait for someone like Manny Pacquiao. Uh, obviously, we're doing all this waiting sometimes. You know, obviously, I hope it pays off. Uh, but in the meanwhile, it's not like I'm just out of the gym. I'm still in the gym training. I'm, uh, you know, I don't, it's not like I don't do anything. Uh, I'm still yeah. training and keeping myself taking over and working on my mistakes and improving as a fighter. And next year, if you got Pacquiao and let's say Kel Brook in England, it'd be a game. massive year. That'd be a massive year for me, definitely. To get a good win off um, uh, Manny Pacquiao and then you knock out Kel Brook, I, mean, I think that'll be a great year for me. Absolutely. Yeah, what up, boxing fans? I just wanted to give my opinion on um, Amir Khan risking his career to um, wait on Manny Pacquiao. And I think that's a huge mistake, man, to put all your trust in Bob Arum. I mean, you could get the fight, but you're taking a big risk with your career, man. And I don't know if Bob Arum is trustworthy to put all your faith in Bob Arum. Because um, if you wait on Manny Pacquiao... You, you, you're probably going to be left fighting a bum if Bob Arum picks Tim Bradley or Terrence Crawford or picks anyone else. That's a huge mistake to put all your trust in Bob Arum, man. I don't know if, if Amir Khan's uncle is advising him or his wife or Al Heyman. I don't know who's who's um putting this idea in his head to wait on Manny Pacquiao. And I respect that he want to fight the best. He want to fight. He want to fight the best. And uh, Manny Pacquiao is one of the best. So you got to respect that. But I would have made. I would have asked them to give me a, a answer um, in October. They would have had to give me an answer in October. There's no way I would have put my career at risk to wait on Manny Pacquiao because you're not gonna get Kell Brook, Danny Garcia. You're not gonna get any big fight if you wait until April. All those fighters are going to be signed to fight somebody else, man. And you're going to be left fighting a bum. That's a huge mistake waiting on Bob Arum, man. There's no way I would do that if it was me. But um, hopefully Bob Arum don't fuck you over, man. Hopefully you get the Manny Pacquiao fight because that's a big gamble. You're taking a big risk, man. And I hate to say this because Amir Khan is one of my favorite fighters. But if you wait to April and Bob Arum don't give you that fight, your career could, could possibly be, it could possibly be over. Looking at the facts, it could it could you 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 um you putting your career in jeopardy, man. Waiting on Bob Arum, and that's a dangerous mistake that I wouldn't do. But uh, hopefully he get that fight with Pacquiao because um he putting his career in jeopardy, and he they talking about Kell Brook. He's not he's not even gonna get Kell Brook if you don't get that fight against Pacquiao. You know basically. Kel Brook is already going to be signed to fight someone else. So, um, I just had to give my opinion on that. Give my opinion. I would not wait on Bob Arum. He would have to give me a decision either October or November. Wait in the April to, know, to wait on Manny Pacquiao, even though he's a good fighter, man. That's a huge mistake. And, uh, Hopefully the gamble pays off and you get the Pacquiao fight, but I just don't trust Bob Arum. I don't trust Bob Arum one bit, man, because he was already going to sell you out for Lucas Matisse until Matisse got knocked out. Bob Arum is not the guy to trust, man, with your career. I'm telling you, but uh, it seems like American is putting all his trust in Bob Arum. And uh, I'm hoping that Bob Arum don't fuck him, fuck, fuck him over, man. But uh. You never know. So um, I just wanted to leave you guys with, with that. And uh, 